Hi guys. Hello. I am Blunt Boss KP and this is Bruja from the YouTube channel Spooky Time with Bruja and I have my own channel Blunt Boss. So today we uh, ordered Mr. Boss or Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast. I'm thinking about myself. Sorry, uh, Mr. Beast burgers, and they should be here any minute. So, as inspiring YouTube channel, or as inspiring, you know, YouTube stars or YouTube creators, um, we thought it'd be fun to do a video to try Mr. Beast's burgers since Mr. Beast is one of the biggest YouTubers. Actually, he probably is the biggest YouTuber in the world right now, so. Um, we're gonna go see what the burgers look like. Yeah. yeah. Should be here any minute. Right. She's about one minute away. One minute. I'm excited. The burgers actually looked really good, so. And I read reviews about the seasoned fries. I guess we'll find out. Ooh! One minute away. So what do you do on your channel? Sorry. Wow. <laughs> okay. Listen, it's been a long day. All right. <laughs> um, I talk about spooky stuff and do some investigations. No way. And I also promote any type of like spooky stuff that's out there if you guys are ever interested in it. Spooky Time and Bruja. Yeah, check it out. Spooky Time and Bruja. You have like 40, 40 subscribers. Something like that, yeah. Mm, I it's don't know, it sounds suspicious. <laughs> How did you get all those subscribers? <laughs> hmm. People I know. Yeah. Oh, she's picking up the goods. Sweet. I know. This means I love you. I mean, Aww. I guess I do love you, but. <laughs> Wow, look at it. We got Ooh, it. That's so cool. Exciting. All right. Hi, guys. So we got our Mr. Beast burger, and we are going to have it. First, I'd like to introduce Bruja again. This is Bruja. She has her own channel, Spooky Town with Bruja. And thank you for coming. Oh, we're doing each other's show, so. <laughs> so cool. Partnership. Alright. Smells good. Smells good. And we just had a download on Mr. Beast. So, Mr. Beast is 23 years old. He was born in Kansas. And he moved to North Carolina, where he has been ever since. And he has millions. Like... Millions. 70 millions. I mean, like, probably, you know, who knows? Like, we don't even know. He probably, his net worth is probably fake. I mean. Can I just say how cute the whole thing is? <laughs> I mean, look at this. They give you a little cup with your soda in it. Like, that's adorable. That is adorable. So, what do we have? Fries. Nice. Carl's grilled cheese. Which Yay. is what you got. Uh, I got the Mr. Beast burger, the double, Ooh, and then, that is. no, I got the beast style fries. Ooh. No, you want ice no, it's okay. Oh wow, you're so fancy. Oh wow. Oh, wow. That's cool. We got our own little Mr. Beast cup now, and that's cool. It that is cool. Keep that. Going. Who is it, Carl? Who's no, that? who's uh? That's uh. Is it Mr. Bro? I was it. Mr. Bro. That would be his brother. His brother, Mr. Bro. Mm -hmm. So that's cool. I mean, okay, so if you don't know who Mr. Beast is, he's like the most popular YouTuber on 
on the planet. I mean, periods. And, uh... It's crazy the things he does. We were just watching one where he's paying whoever can stay for as long as they can in a circle. What is it? Half a million dollars? Half a million dollars. Half a million. Oh. And the thing is that, like, even the people that lost still got stuff. Like, that's crazy. Yeah, I mean, they still, I mean, the first guy who. The first guy who left got a brand new car. Brand new car. I mean, people, people were just getting thousands of dollars. And not to mention, like, they're on there. So they get that publicity of being there. And yeah. I mean, just to meet Mr. Beast, I think, would be That's really cool. cool. Like, he seems just, like a really cool guy. Just to have that opportunity, yeah. Oh, wow. He just seems so down to earth. Dang, that looks good. Uh-oh. Is it? All right. All right, so I got the Mr. Beast. This is supposed to be, like, a patty now, right? Yeah. Oh, and I got the... I like how they put the brown mustard on it. I don't even know what this tablet is. Oh, it's just like an onions, and... I mean, they're not that many, so it's not bad. I'm gonna try it. Mmm. That cheese, though. I like it. Mmm. Mmm. Let's try it. Mmm. Mmm. Tell you what, that bread is delicious. Mm -hmm. Crinkle cut fudge. Oh, my favorite. Ooh, and the seasoning. Did you get the seasoning or no seasoning? I don't know. I got my fries mm. beef style. So I guess that means with sauce and uh. Yeah, what does beef style mean? I think sauce, and I think they put something else on it. Oh, yeah. Okay, so it comes with, uh, looks like cheese, ketchup, mayo, uh, the brown mustard, and chopped onions. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty good. The fries alone are really good. Hmm? I like it. I love the brown mustard. Yes, thank you, Mr. Beast. That's so, so good. I like how they give you the bottle. Right? So I guess Mr. Beast Burger, I was reading into and there's a bunch of locations everywhere and there's no, there's like no sit down restaurants. So they cook all in house and then everything gets delivered. So that's for like that's new age. That's pretty cool. And I saw I can't remember who the company was, but Mr. Beast started it himself with this company of this idea of like just the kitchen. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Kind of like no, you don't have to entertain customers and guests. You know, I mean, why not? You can we can eat in the comfort of our home. <laughs> But, I mean, you know, that's just an extra step they have to take care of. I mean, I think it's smart. Yeah. I think it's smart. I mean, he, he's a millionaire. Who, who am I? Huh? A future millionaire. Everyone's <laughs> talked to him. I did with him for about six years before oh, yeah. he started really gaining um, viewers. And he started going into getting more different type of videos that he would post. He used to just post like gamer videos. That's it, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, like Minecraft, Call of Duty. Oh yeah. And then he started doing other things and people started watching. <laughs> he went to college for two weeks and then dropped out and decided that was not for him. <laughs> so that's cool. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, he had a a vision of what he wanted, and he got it. His first, his first virtual video, he counted to some ridiculous number, and it was him literally just counting. Mm -hmm. And then he just kept doing these videos where he was, I'll do this for six hours, or 
I'll do this 200 times. You know, it's just videos like that. I mean, people just got hooked on them and they were with him. I mean, they, and he just grew. But I guess the first account he had, he deleted. And then he, he, he came back to it. He had like two videos up and he left and he had like a couple thousand viewers. And then he stopped left for a couple months, then came back to it. And if you didn't know before, he was Mr. Beast 6,000 before he dropped the 6,000 and officially became Mr. Beast. So mm -hmm. it was pretty neat. Pretty neat come up. Wow. He's 23, mm -hmm. 23 years old, imagine. Um. Pretty funny that his mom works for him now. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Refused to tell him to stop making videos because he anyway. And she works for him. Yeah, now she works for him. She he gave her a hundred thousand dollars. Wow. What an accomplishment. She must be so proud of him. So proud of him now, you know what I mean? She didn't believe him at first, remember? Yeah. I thought he was lying. <laughs> <laughs> I think a lot of parents think that. How do you make money on YouTube, you know? Mm -hmm. You did it. And the good thing she was, he gives a lot of money away to good causes, so. Yeah. People that really do know. Mm-hmm. Not just like spending it all on himself, so that's cool. Yeah, they said that um, he didn't want Lamborghinis or anything flashy. That he's pretty down to earth. I mean, if you can see him in his videos, he he just like portrays that he's yeah. a normal Joe. You know, he's a normal beast. <laughs> <laughs> so that, and he hired all his all of his friends, mm -hmm. which is, I think, the coolest thing that. He brought them along and he, one of his friends doesn't like editing, but he taught him how to do it so he could bring them along for the ride. And I think that's pretty cool. I dropped my napkin. Uh oh. Uh oh. So why do you do the YouTube? I do YouTube <laughs> because it's a platform where I can porch or I can show my message and I want other others to learn about cannabis products and just information, knowledge, where they can go just to better themselves in the cannabis field so people don't feel lost. I mean, there's going to be a huge wave of information, just everything. The market is booming and it's booming faster than we can even we can even catch up so i just want to kind of kind of be that catch up for you for uh, my viewers and add value to their lives and excuse me and bring you know if they're talking to their friends they, if they watch my video they'll be like you know i know this about cannabis because of blunt boss and they'll be like that's exactly what i want to do you know i just want to better those who want to know about cannabis I just want to empower them with knowledge that I I know and that I'm learning here in, here in Colorado. So it's really cool. Well, you... I don't have that big <laughs> Oh, wow. All right. <laughs> Mine is just simply entertainment. I mean, I really like spooky stuff, and it's really just a platform for me to talk about it, show people different places that we've gone to that have supposedly haunted, you know, either um, objects or homes, whatever. Um, I also like to just give like little history lessons, I guess, about what where we go. So that's fun. It's great. I love it. I love it. I love its entertainment. Like we all need to be entertained, and that's just for fun. And I know there's a lot of people out there that enjoy spooky, paranormal, creepy things. Why not just talk about it? Who was the inspiration for your channel? Um, what do you mean? Was there a YouTuber you watch or follow? Oh. 
Um, no, not really. I mean, I've, I've seen a lot of different aspects of like ghost stories. Um, I really like Bailey Sarian. I like the true crime aspect in that she just kind of talks about the situation for people. Um, and that's what I wanted to do. I just want to talk about it. Like, I don't want to sit there and like bore you, but I just want to like talk to you and conversate. So, yeah, it's fun. It is yeah. cool. Yeah, I love your videos. And I love your stories. They're great too. Oh, yeah, those stories that I write originally too. Those are fun to do. Um, I do like to write them. So to share them on a platform like that would be really cool too. And didn't you just write a story yes. that you entered into a contest? I did. Um, it did very well. I did win, but you know, I'm getting there. And I might probably read it on the next episode. So, oh, great. Yeah. I'm looking forward to you that. Know, lots of, some people don't like to read, but they like to hear them. So. Yeah, no, like I, I like audiobooks. I, I like read. I like yeah. reading your work. I think it's very. I mean, it catches you. It keeps you drawn in, and I just love your style. So, I, yeah. I love reading your work. But yeah, I mean, people love listening to it too. You know, if they're going to work or something. Or... Yeah, it's something you can definitely just like put on and listen to it. And, I mean, I try to read it as well as I can, so that you guys can. Hear. I know I'm kind of soft spoken, so <laughs> I try to speak up a little more. But it's fun. You're an inspiring Edgar Allan Poe. He used to read his poem, The Raven, at the university. Oh, yeah. So, Fun. and now you're doing it on YouTube. Ha! One day. One day. <laughs> All right. So how about we finish our Mr. Beast food and uh, enjoy the rest of our night and yeah. call thank it a night. Thank you for having me on your channel. Oh, yes. Thank, thank you, you for having me on your channel. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. I, you know, we it's good to work with each other in the YouTube community, I believe, and... We just want to, I think, better each other and, you know, just bring bring the best content we can to you guys, really, because that's what it's all about. I mean, sure, it is about us and we do love what we do, but, you know, the reason why we created these YouTube channels was because there was nothing in our niche that we could find that we absolutely loved. So... We call, you know, we uh, took the call to duty and the call to action, and here we are, and we're doing it. So, you know, here's yeah. here's to us, and here's Ooh. to Mr. Beast, Hi. and here's to YouTube. You know, I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, video, and we enjoyed making it. This burger is delicious. Yeah, I can't wait to finish it. it. Yeah. So if you guys, if you yeah, guys want. Here. Yeah, order Mr. Beast. It is good. All right, guys. We'll see you later. Thank you for watching. Have a good night. Enjoy. Bye.